there welcome to today's lesson today i want to teach you things you should know now these things are the basic things you should know i'm going to show you how to fill in in between chord changes now this is it i play that song on the key of a okay the a major scale is this Its chord progression is being picked out from this scale from the A major scale. That is the key I play the song on. How to approach the song? The progression of the song is Jehovah is your name. That is what you as a bass player will play. Jehovah to saw then you go to one so which is one four then you go to your five five one okay the other part of the song we say is mighty warrior so you're doing do, 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 fa. then you go to your soul yeah. is your name basically this is this simple progression of that song this is the foundation of the song this is the simple progression of the song if you want to spice it up using some passing movement, you can do this. Jehovah is your name. See? The passing movement is Do, Re, Mi, Do, Fa. That is it. Now, the passing movement for the fire is Do, Re, Mi, Do, Fa. You're going to saw. Another passing movement you can use is If you notice I apply some little technique The vibrato What was the note I played? This is my Do, Re, Mi, Fa, Sol, La, Ti, Do, Re So I started from Re Re, Do, Re, Do, La, so. That's a simple passing note to your saw, to your five chord to your four chord you did do re mi do fa which is your one two three one four now for the saw you're going to saw saw is your next chord progression you're going so you're doing re do la so re do la so which is your two one six five that's your passing notes to saw anytime, any day. Okay? Re, do, la, so. Re, so. Then you go. Do. That is it. That is how to start spicing your progression. Okay, so that's the first movement I want to show you on the song. Now, you can also do this. So you can actually repeat movement. Okay? I did You also need to follow timing. Okay? Now, this movement, I just finished using the chromatic movement on the chord i'm going to that's the chromatic passing notes 
to the five chord I'm going. Re, la, si, so. Don't forget to six, flat six, five. Then I repeated it again. On the D string and on the G string. On the E string and on the A string, this is it. Re, la, si, so. I repeated it again. Now, using the right fingering also matters. So, the... that is it simple passing movement passing notes to your chord changes so if you can get it realize it so. da, da. everything together so you hear uh, it sound let's go i'm going to the five chord harmony now you're going to the next part of the song mighty warrior now the second movement I want to show you going to your four chord, going to your five is do, so, fa, mi, do, fa. That's it. Which will be your do five four three one four. These are just notes of the A major scale. Okay? Let's go. Now, the next movement to your five chord will be five, six, two, five. Sol, la, re, so, five, six, two, five. That's the fingering. Five, six, two, five. Five, six, two, five. Which is sol, la, sol, la, re, so. You drop to your five chord. Okay? So let's go. Let's add sol, fa, mi. Then on the five chord you're doing so that's how you're going. That's it. Now when you put everything together, the first move is do re mi. Next move going to your five chord you played re la si so you repeated it again re la si so so do okay which is your one two three one four then your five chord you played two six flat six five you repeated it again two six flat six five then you climb up to five then you end it one harmonizing it okay the second time you're going to play do five so for me which is your five four three one four then your next move you're playing five six two five okay two five So let's go everything together.
The next move I want to show you on the song is Mighty Warrior. That one we are going to apply the A major 7th arpeggio using it to serve as passing movement to our 4 chord. So this is how it will sound. how we are going to go a major seventh arpeggio the fingers i made use of i did not bother to use the ring finger again because i want to take some move again going to my four chord so the notes there are do mi so ti la so fa mi going to my four chord okay that's a movement to your four chord using the major seven a major seven that bet you're linking it you can also do so it's easy this way you see now i use the ring finger on the seven do mi so ti la so fa mi Okay, we just use the A major 7th arpeggio to serve as passing notes to the 4 chord. That is it. Which can also be played this way. Now, on the 7, I use ring. Why going that way? Why going this way? Now, I can as well do this. Using the ring, the index finger on the 7, on the T. So that's it. So on that part, Mighty Warrior, we are going to use that move linking to our four. Then on the five chord, we are going to do this. Re, mi, fa, re, so. That's a movement to your five chord. So la, re, mi, fa, re, so. Number five, six, two, three, four, two, five. That's what we are going to use on the five chord. Let's go. just the major seventh arpeggio i use to serve as passing movement to my four chord Six, five, four, three. 